Jay Inslee has been everywhere lately. You know that we have to up our game. Opioids, orcas. When we save the orcas from climate change. Energy. A clean energy smart deal for the state of Washington. Mental health. To replace some of those very, very aging buildings. Billions worth of ideas and a new tax too. At least we're starting from the common ground of shared priorities and then we'll work through. Democrat Christine Rolfs is the state Senate's lead budget writer and says Inslee's $675 million mental health funding request has promise. That cap gains item, another story. Of everything he proposed, that is most likely to get the most airtime in the legislature. Whether we have the votes to pass it, we'll see. Republicans have been quick to seize on the issue. It's just an income tax with another name, and you would have to be really naive to think that it isn't an income tax and that it wouldn't grow with time. Republican Senate Minority Leader Mark Schessler points to new numbers released this week from the state's Economic and Revenue Forecast Council showing collections up $114 million over the November forecast, sales tax collections way up. Certainly with exceptional growth, low unemployment, we can live within our means. Rolf says she doesn't see the math the same way, but also acknowledges there could be a bigger fight over eliminating a legislative mandated local levy lid for school districts, which some have claimed has led to mass teacher layoffs. It will be a challenge to find a consensus to move forward. Chris Daniels, King 5 News.